To create a secure base for our tower, an 8.5 metre basement had to be excavated and filled with 4,750 tonnes of concrete. On May the 30th we had the first of two major concrete pours to the Brighton I-360 site, a delicate operation that involved coordinating 200 vehicles and taking over three local concrete plants. It's, it's the first of our large uh, volume concrete pours today, so we're going to pour about 1,200 cubic metres of concrete today. We started at 6am this morning with the first load in, um, and things so far so good. Uh, the thing is with the concrete pours are that once you start them, you've really got to, you've, you've, you've got to finish it. You have no other choice. From an engineering perspective, uh, we can't allow any uh, cold joints to form in the concrete while it's curing. So yes, so, so far so good. So for today's pour, um, it's about 150 vehicle uh, deliveries to be made today. Um, we've got three concrete pumps out on site to pump the concrete into the basement. We've got one that's kept in reserve as well. So the reserve one there, just in case everything breaks down. Uh, we've obviously, we have a, a large amount of vehicle marshals here today as well. We have 10 marshals that control all the vehicle movements to make sure that while we're passing through obviously a busy pedestrianised area on the seafront to make sure that uh, obviously the, the public safety is uh, always kept in the, uh, you know, the number one priority at all times. Yeah, and really exciting now the tower's due from uh, Rotterdam and all of a sudden things will be uh, things will be on the up so to speak.